Guys, welcome back to the channel. My name's Chris. I'm just another review guy. Today we're going to circle back to one of my old reviews, which is the Chemical Guys Woolly Mammoth Drying Towel. Yep, this drying towel. I did a video on this, I don't know, six months or so ago. Got some criticisms on it, so I wanted to try to improve, so I'm redoing the video. Alright guys, so the Woolly Mammoth towel by Chemical Guys. It's a nice big towel. This towel can hold up to one gallon of water. It won't tear. It won't rip no matter how hard you pull it. It has the branded Chemical Guys silk border which prevents it from tearing but also prevents it from scratching while drying your car. This towel can easily dry this 3 series behind me with one towel. My Z4, most of your four-door cars. I've also dried full-size Ford F-150 Lariats, so the full-size four-door versions. Dried one whole truck with one towel, except when it got towards the end, it kind of stretched a little bit because it was an asshole, dude. God damn, ass cars. Hate that shit. It's like, if you're gonna rev your goddamn car, at least make sure it's a nice car, not some piece of muffler on it. God, it's so annoying. Okay, done venting. I don't think I'll leave that in the video, but maybe I will, because if you drive a dilapidated piece of with no muffler, stop revving that dude. It's a junk car. Go buy yourself another one. Anyways, so, like I was saying, this towel has the silk border around it, so it won't rip or tear, it won't scratch while you're drying. Guys, so what we're going to do is we're going to spray down this black car. We're going to do a couple drying techniques. There's also a hack from Chemical Guys for drying a little bit easier. We'll do that in another video. So guys, let's, uh, let's get to it. Let's go and do a couple techniques on the hood. Alright guys, so there's two ways that you can go about drying your car with the Woolly Mammoth Town. The first way is to just lay it on the hood or the body panel. And you can go ahead and pat it down. Pick it up. And I'll show you guys how dry it is. Hopefully it's coming through on video. So you can see wet, dry, wet, dry. So that's just laying it down. other way which is I think the fastest and most productive way to dry your car with this towel is to just take it throw it out and as you can see it's not perfect because in life no one is and you just drag it across the hood when you get to a point where you got a little bit of a the towel's a little bit wetter in one area than the other. You can always try to find a dry spot. This towel's pretty damp still, but uh, let's go ahead and keep drying it. All right, guys, so as you can see, the Woolly Mammoth towel is an amazing towel. Like I said, it can hold up to one gallon of water, won't scratch your ride unless you're drying your car when it's dirty. Not going to tear it, not going to rip it. To maintain this towel, you can use microfiber wash in your washing machine to clean all your microfiber towels. Link in the description below. Or throw it in the washer, uh, some light soap, and I use fabric softener just a little bit, just for the smell. And then I hang dry the towel. I don't put it in the dryer. I'm not sure if you can or not. There's no directions that say you can't do it, but I hang dry these in my garage and they dry in a couple days. So guys, hope you enjoyed the video. Hope this was informative for you. If you would like to pick one of these towels up, which I recommend you do, I highly recommend these towels. Links in the description below. As always, I appreciate you watching and have a great day. Keep on washing your cars. Peace.